Right motorheads, welcome to the video. The Benelli Lianchino 800 is Benelli's bigger brother to the Lianchino 500, the true Lion Cup, which is a modern interpretation of the original Lianchino 500 back from the 50s. But this Ottocento comes with a 754cc parallel twin with around 76 horsepower and 67 newton meters of torque. And this parallel twin cylinder engine has a really nice even spread of power. And with the smooth changes from the six speed gearbox, this thing really likes to get up and go in any gear. There's 50 millimeter upside down forks at the front and a single monoshock at the rear. And the suspension really kept me comfortable during every part of my ride. There's twin 320 millimeter discs up front and a single 260 millimeter disc at the rear with full ABS and the brakes were solid and responsive easily bringing this 222 kilo Leoncino to a stop 17 inch wheels both front and rear a seat height of around 805 millimeters making flat footing super easy and a big colourful, easy to read TFT dash. The stock exhaust on the Lee and Chino 800 also gives a really, really nice sound. So what I have here is the Benelli Leoncino Ottocento or Lion Cub 800. So I think it was back in 2015 or 16 they brought out the new Leoncino 500 and this is the big one, this is the 800. There's four variants in the Leoncino range. There's the Leoncino Cinquecento which is the 500 and that comes like this as a naked road bike as well as the trail which is a bit more of a scrambler like and then you've got the two above that which is the Leoncino Ottocento and the Ottocento trail so the 800 which is this and the 800 trail so you can see the little line cub on the front of the uh, front fender I think it's a really classy touch from Benelli Now first impressions on this bike, I find it really, really good to ride. Nice, really, really wide bars, easy to handle. She's got plenty of grunt too, for an 800cc twin. This is the forest green colour, and I think it looks really nice. It's my pick of the bunch colour-wise. Nice trellis frame. You see the attention to detail, nice TFT dash, which is great to read. Provides you with plenty of information. You see the radiator says water cooled. 
LED lights all around. So far from riding it, it does it and it does it easy. It doesn't try and pretend that it's something that it's not. Definitely, definitely impressive with the Leoncino Ottocento. Well, I'm going to suit up, slide the helmet back on, and well, let's go riding. The build quality is fantastic, but it's the little touches on this bike. From the name on the engine casings, the tank badge, to the little line cup on the front fender, and even the grips, a real attention to detail. The Lean Chino 800 doesn't try to be something that it's not. It's a solid road going motorcycle that's capable, easy to use, easy to handle and easy to live with, with plenty of power. And in my opinion, if you're after a no fuss motorcycle, then consider test riding the Leoncino 800 from Benelli. So motorheads, that was just my thoughts on the Leoncino Ottocento from Benelli. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, give us a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. As always, I would love to hear your thoughts, so please leave a comment. And thank you to Black Metal Motor Co for allowing me to take the bike out and film this review. So Black Metal Motor Co do stock the full range of Benelli motorcycles, so go and check them out if you're interested. And of course, all information will be in the description down below. So motorheads, thanks for watching, take care, stay safe, and I'll see you on the next one.